Well, enjoy it while it lasts. That's basically <laughs> that's basically mm. the takeaway. Tomorrow okay. is a pretty nice day. It's going to be sunny. It'll be a little on the cool side. But by the end of the week, it is going to be downright mm. cold okay. outside. And a few folks, especially north and west, may see some flakes late Thursday night. If you stay up late enough, okay. may see some flakes. It's looking like late Thursday night as opposed to some early flurries. Friday morning. Now, just a, a few flurries okay. here and there. Maybe some light accumulations if you're in the Pocono Mountains. That's about it. We may see a few flakes early. It would really be late Friday night mixing in with the last of the rain in the city. That's the most you're going to see. Don't get too excited about it. But it is really signifying the change the winds of change, let's say, that are heading our way by Friday. Let's start off with a look outside right now. We'll take you out to another live look at the center city skyline, which looks good tonight. But the clouds are still hanging on, and that's keeping temperatures relatively mild right now. We're still at 54 degrees in Philly, 51 in Lancaster, and in Reading, and 51 in Atlantic City. Once the clouds move on out and skies clear, we will start to see those temperatures drop on a cloudy night. Clouds almost act like a blanket on you when you sleep as your body releases radiation. The blanket kind of traps that and keeps you warm. If you don't have the blanket, all that body heat just escapes out into space. Kind of the same process with clouds in the Earth's surface. As the Earth's surface cools, if you have clouds overhead, they kind of trap that and keep you a little warmer. On a clear night, temps drop a lot faster. Wind speeds right now, we still have a little breeze from the west. You can see 8 miles an hour in the city, about 14 miles per hour in Reading right now. A look at the big picture. Storm Scan 3, again, showing a cool front, which is moving through the area now. That's what's bringing the cloud cover. That's getting out of here pretty quickly, but it's this next system that's starting to kind of gain legs over portions of the northern plains that's going to come through here for us on Thursday. Behind it, locked up across central Canada, there's a lot of cold air, and we are going to be tapping into that. We're going to be opening the freezer door here by late Thursday night, and when you wake up on Friday, it's going to feel like we've already made the switch to winter. Now, likely will not stay that way, but it does look like a bit of a prolonged chilly spell. So tonight, mainly clear. Tomorrow is sunny, cool, but pleasant. Probably the nicest day of the seven-day forecast. Here's our late week storm. Now, it comes in as rain late Thursday. Thursday. Most of the cold will arrive as the rain is exiting. It may mix with a few flakes on the back edge. Could be a period of light snow slush for the Poconos. That would be Thursday night, and there may be some accumulations. Our latest models coming in with a little more snow for the Poconos, maybe an inch or two here in the highest elevations. Not much anywhere else. Maybe again a few flakes mixing in late Thursday night as that front clears. But it's a pretty prolonged cold snap. It's chilly Friday, a little bit better here on Sunday, and then even colder early next week. Look at all that cold over eastern Canada, and we're going to tap into some of that Monday into Tuesday. So your eyewitness weather seven-day forecast, well, first we've got the record cold high, 42 Friday. The record cold high for Friday's date is also 42. It's a full 17 degrees below average, and not only that, Friday's 42 may feel more like 32 with the wind. Oof. Saturday's cold, Sunday's a little better. Next Tuesday's even colder than Friday with that secondary wave of cold air. So I don't have a ton of good news here tonight. <laughs> Yikes. Moving right along to Don Bell. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Sean. Sorry. That. Uh, that forecast is rough every single time I hear it. Yeah, it doesn't get better. Be strong, yeah. my man. Be yeah. strong. Do the best we can. All right.